Did you hear about the fervent support Sean Hannity and Ainsley Earhart have been receiving from fans ever since their touching display at Pete Hegseth and Jennifer Rochette's wedding? There's a palpable sense that they might be ready to take their relationship to the next level, and their tender gestures towards each other have only fueled fans' hopes. Yet, despite the mounting speculation, they've managed to keep their relationship status shrouded in mystery. Hannity remains steadfast in his refusal to divulge anything about his personal life, while Earhart's playful demeanor keeps fans on edge. So, what exactly is the truth behind their relationship? Find the answer in this video. There is an undeniable truth that the alleged romantic relationship between Sean Hannity and Ainsley Earhart has sparked quite the intrigue. At the center of this purported affair is the collision of two prominent figures in the Fox News universe, adding an extra layer of fascination for audiences and commentators alike. The whispers of romance gained traction when Hannity and Earhart made a notable appearance at the 2019 wedding ceremony of fellow Fox colleagues Pete Hegseth and Jennifer Rauschet. It wasn't just their presence that turned heads, but the extravagant manner in which they arrived. Reports surfaced, alleging that the duo stole the spotlight by making a grand entrance via helicopter, an ostentatious gesture that undoubtedly raised eyebrows among attendees. Vanity Fair, known for its keen eye on the inner workings of media personalities, didn't let this spectacle go unnoticed. According to their account, Hannity and Earhart seemed to be more than just friends attending a colleague's wedding. Their behavior, while not explicitly confirming any romantic involvement, hinted at a closeness that went beyond professional courtesy. Despite the murmurs and speculations swirling around them, both Hannity and Earhart have remained tight-lipped about the nature of their relationship, at least publicly. Colleagues and insiders within the Fox News network have reportedly noticed the chemistry between the two, but are met with a wall of silence whenever the topic arises. The carefully crafted responses from both Sean Hannity and Ainsley Earhart regarding their alleged romantic involvement add another layer of mystery to the swirling rumors. In the art of public relations and media management, such statements are akin to a delicate dance, offering neither confirmation nor denial while maintaining a veneer of privacy and professionalism. Hannity's terse declaration, delivered through a spokesperson, is characteristic of his no-nonsense approach to handling inquiries about his personal life. I do not discuss my personal life in public, he states, a phrase often used by public figures to deflect intrusive questioning. This succinct remark leaves little room for interpretation, effectively shutting down any further probing into his romantic affairs. Earhart's response follows a similar vein, although it carries a slightly different tone. With a focus on her role as a mother and her dedication to her daughter, she subtly shifts the conversation away from her own personal life and towards her familial responsibilities. Right now, I am focused on raising my daughter, she asserts, framing her priorities in a relatable and sympathetic light. However, it's the latter part of Earhart's statement that adds an intriguing twist to the narrative. By offering praise for Hannity and emphasizing his qualities as a person, she indirectly fuels speculation about their relationship, while simultaneously distancing herself from any romantic involvement. As anyone at Fox News will tell you, Sean is a wonderful person, and whomever he chooses to date will be extremely fortunate, she states, subtly acknowledging their close relationship within the network while maintaining a firm stance on her own relationship status. The final nail in the coffin comes with Earhart's unequivocal denial. I am not dating anyone. This definitive statement seems to put an end to any speculation regarding her romantic entanglements, at least for the time being. Yet the careful wording of her response leaves open the possibility of future developments, should circumstances change. Anyone who knows Sean Hannity and Ainsley Earhart knows that both individuals have traversed the complexities of marriage and divorce with their respective journeys contributing to the enigmatic allure that surrounds them. 
First, Hannity's romantic history is intertwined with his former spouse, Jill Rhodes, with whom he exchanged vows in 1993. Their union endured for over two decades, characterized by shared experiences and the joys of parenthood. Joys of par Together, they welcomed a son named Patrick and a daughter named Mary Kelly into the world, solidifying their familial bond. However, despite the outward appearance of stability, their marriage ultimately succumbed to the pressures of time, leading to their separation and eventual divorce. Next, Earhart's own matrimonial story paints a picture of love found and lost. Her marriage to financial advisor Will Proctor in 2012 marked the beginning of a new chapter in her life, one filled with hope and promise. The arrival of their daughter, Hayden, further cemented their union, offering glimpses of domestic bliss amid the rigors of public life. Yet, as is often the case, the fairy tale began to unravel, culminating in their divorce in 2019. Then the whispers of a burgeoning romance between Sean Hannity and Ainsley Earhart reached a crescendo during the unprecedented times of the coronavirus pandemic. As the world grappled with lockdowns and social distancing measures, the dynamics of their alleged relationship unfolded against the backdrop of quarantine life, adding a layer of intrigue to their already captivating narrative. Reports emerged detailing their shared experiences during this period, fueling speculation about the nature of their connection. Hannity, a longtime resident of Long Island, found himself in the company of Earhart, who had reportedly sought refuge in the Hamptons by renting a house during the pandemic. It was here, amidst the tranquil surroundings of Oyster Bay, that their paths seemingly converged igniting rumors of a romance in the making. The intertwining of their lives became increasingly apparent as Earhart made use of Hannity's at-home studio to fulfill her professional duties, hosting Fox and Friends remotely. This symbiotic arrangement not only facilitated their work commitments, but also provided ample opportunity for their bond to flourish behind closed doors. Insiders privy to the inner workings of their relationship corroborated the rumors, painting a picture of two individuals entwined in a romance that defied the confines of speculation. They have been quarantining together in Oyster Bay, revealed an insider to page six, offering a glimpse into the intimacy of their shared isolation. Another source affirmed the nature of their connection, unequivocally stating, they are 100% dating. Despite the mounting evidence and whispers within media circles, Hannity remained resolute in his silence, steadfastly guarding the privacy of his personal life. His reluctance to address the rumors stems from a combination of fame, controversy, and a desire to shield his private affairs from the relentless scrutiny of the public eye. He's very private because he's very famous and he's very controversial, remarked an insider to People, shedding light on the complexities of navigating fame in the age of relentless media scrutiny. In contrast, Earhart adopted a more transparent approach, offering glimpses into her relationship goals and aspirations. Yet even her candor couldn't fully dispel the mystery surrounding her connection with Hannity, leaving observers to speculate about the true nature of their bond. Ainsley Earhart's candid conversation with People in October 2019 offers a poignant insight into her innermost desires and aspirations, shedding light on her journey towards finding love and navigating the complexities of relationships. Despite her repeated denials regarding any romantic involvement with Sean Hannity, her words reveal a woman grappling with the aftermath of divorce while remaining hopeful for the future. As a divorced mother, Earhart's primary concern lies with her daughter, Hayden, whom she hopes to provide with a positive example of love and commitment. Her desire to find love again is not merely for her own fulfillment, but also stems from a heartfelt longing to demonstrate the beauty and resilience of love to her young daughter. I would love to find love again, and I want to demonstrate a loving relationship for Hayden one day. Earhart expressed earnestly, her words resonating with a blend of vulnerability and determination. 
Her journey towards finding love is imbued with a sense of purpose, driven by a desire to create a nurturing and supportive environment for her daughter to thrive in. Despite her eagerness to embark on this journey, Earhart approaches it with a sense of patience and faith, acknowledging that true love cannot be rushed or forced. I know that God will put the right man in my life if that's his will and he'll do it in his time, she remarked, drawing strength from her faith and trust in divine timing. Ainsley Earhart's candid revelations about her fertility journey and her openness to expanding her family provide a deeper glimpse into her hopes and aspirations beyond her career. In her interview, she candidly discussed her proactive approach to family planning, revealing that she has taken steps to preserve her fertility by freezing her eggs. The decision to freeze her eggs reflects Earhart's pragmatic outlook and her determination to keep her options open as she navigates the complexities of modern motherhood. Despite the challenges posed by her age, she remains optimistic about the possibility of welcoming more children into her life. I have frozen my eggs, so I am prepared if I decide to have more children, Earhart revealed, showcasing her proactive mindset and her willingness to embrace unconventional paths to parenthood. Her readiness to explore alternative options underscores her deep-seated desire to expand her family and experience the joys of motherhood once again. Having welcomed her daughter Hayden later in life, Earhart acknowledges the unique blessings and challenges that come with being an older mother. However, rather than viewing her age as a barrier, she sees it as an opportunity to approach motherhood with wisdom, patience, and a greater appreciation for the journey ahead. I had Hayden so late in my life, and I'm in my 40s, so I would be open to that 1,000%, she declared, highlighting her unwavering commitment to embracing the possibilities that lie ahead. Her openness to the idea of meeting someone who already has children speaks to her inclusive and nurturing nature, as she envisions the potential for a blended family dynamic filled with love and joy. Moreover, Earhart's willingness to consider adoption further exemplifies her compassionate spirit and her dedication to making a positive impact in the lives of children in need. Maybe I'll adopt a child, we'll see, she mused, leaving the door open to the possibility of expanding her family through the transformative act of adoption. In stark contrast to Ainsley Earhart's openness about her personal aspirations, Sean Hannity has maintained a steadfast commitment to privacy regarding his romantic history and future endeavors. Despite his high-profile career and status as one of the most recognizable figures in the media, Hannity has chosen to keep intimate details of his personal life closely guarded, shrouding his relationships in a veil of secrecy. The news of Hannity's divorce from Jill Rhodes, his wife of more than 20 years, sent shockwaves through media circles when it broke in June 2020. According to reports from Page Six, the couple had been legally divorced for over a year, with sources revealing that they had been separated for many years prior to that, a revelation that came as a surprise to many who had followed Hannity's public persona closely. Despite the dissolution of their marriage, Hannity and Rhodes have maintained a dignified and amicable relationship, prioritizing their commitment to co-parenting their two children above all else. Their dedication to fostering a harmonious co-parenting dynamic underscores their shared commitment to their family's well-being, despite the challenges posed by their separation. Throughout this period of transition, Hannity has chosen to navigate the complexities of divorce with a sense of discretion and respect for his family's privacy. While speculation may abound regarding the circumstances surrounding their separation, Hannity has refrained from publicly addressing the details of his personal life, opting instead to focus on his professional responsibilities and advocacy efforts. As one of the leading voices in conservative media, Hannity's decision to maintain a low profile regarding his personal affairs reflects his desire to maintain a sense of decorum and professionalism in the public eye. Despite the intense scrutiny that comes with his level of fame, Hannity remains steadfast in his commitment to keeping his private life out of the spotlight, allowing his actions to speak louder than words. 
According to insiders cited by the Daily Mail, Hannity's relentless work ethic and relentless pursuit of professional success may have taken a toll on his marriage. Sean came from nothing, had a workaholic upbringing, and between his shows, books, speeches, he just didn't slow down, it unfortunately broke his marriage, remarked an insider, shedding light on the pressures and sacrifices inherent in Hannity's meteoric rise to prominence. Amidst the speculation surrounding Hannity's divorce, whispers of a potential romance with Ainsley Earhart began to circulate, fueled by their shared experiences within the fast-paced world of media. Observers noted the striking similarities between the two, both in their dedication to their careers and their openness to the possibility of blended family dynamics. We can't help but suggest that a relationship with Earhart might be perfect mused insiders, highlighting the compatibility and understanding that might exist between two individuals navigating the demands of high-profile careers. Earhart's willingness to embrace the complexities of blended family life resonated with Hannity's reputed devotion to his family, leading some to speculate about the potential for a romantic connection between the two. Earhart's openness to the idea of blending their families and her affection for children align with Hannity's reputation as a huge family man, further fueling speculation about the compatibility of their values and lifestyles. Yet despite the tantalizing possibility of a budding romance, both Hannity and Earhart have remained tight-lipped about the nature of their relationship, leaving observers to speculate about what the future may hold. One unconfirmed but plausible rumor about Sean Hannity's hesitation in his relationship with Ainsley Earhart was the negative impact her work schedule had on her family. In a previous marriage, she often necessitated long hours and early mornings that kept her away from her family, including her husband, William Proctor. As detailed in a feature on My Morning Routine, Earhart's day begins in the pre-dawn hours, waking up at 3 a.m. to meticulously prepare for her role as co-host of Fox and Friends alongside Steve Ducey and Brian Kilmeade, a program that kicks off at 6 a.m. In the pre-dawn hours, while most of the world still sleeps, Earhart immerses herself in the day's news, studying her notes and familiarizing herself with the latest developments. With the assistance of a dedicated hair and makeup team, she transforms into the polished and poised presence that millions of viewers have come to recognize. By the time the cameras start rolling at 6 a.m., Earhart is already in full stride, ready to tackle the day's headlines with her trademark blend of professionalism and charm. The morning show whirlwind continues until 9 a.m., but Earhart's workday is far from over. In the hours that follow, she juggles a multitude of responsibilities, from answering work emails to preparing for the next day's show, leaving little time for rest or relaxation. It's a demanding schedule that requires unwavering focus and discipline, leaving little room for leisure or quality time with loved ones. In a 2016 interview with Glamour, Earhart acknowledged the pivotal role that her husband played in supporting her demanding career. I rely on my husband in the mornings because I'm working, she confessed, highlighting the necessity of his support in balancing the demands of work and family life. As the day transitions into the evening, Earhart's commitment to her craft remains unwavering, often requiring late-night study sessions in preparation for the following day's broadcast. While Proctor's support was undoubtedly invaluable, the demands of Earhart's career inevitably placed a strain on their relationship, as the couple struggled to carve out quality time amidst the relentless pace of their respective schedules. Over time, the toll of this dynamic became increasingly apparent, highlighting the challenges that can arise when professional ambitions collide with the complexities of personal relationships. This may have been the cause of Ainsley Earhart's ex-husband's infidelity, causing their marriage to fall apart then. According to reports from a source, whispers of Ainsley Earhart's ex-husband's alleged extramarital affair with one of Earhart's closest friends have sent shockwaves through their social circle, exposing the fragile underpinnings of their once-solid union.
Insiders privy to the couple's inner workings revealed damning details of Proctor's alleged infidelity, painting a picture of betrayal and deceit that struck at the very heart of Earhart's trust. Proctor was unfaithful with one of her closest friends a few years ago, and there is evidence to prove it, divulged a source, shedding light on the devastating revelations that rocked their marriage to its core. For Earhart, the revelation of Proctor's betrayal was nothing short of a gut-wrenching blow, compounded by the fact that the alleged affair had taken place with someone she had considered a confidant. It was all the more devastating for Ainsley that he cheated with someone who she considered one of her closest friends, lamented another source to the Daily Mail, highlighting the profound sense of betrayal and disillusionment that accompanied the revelation. The aftermath of Proctor's alleged infidelity has left Earhart grappling with a maelstrom of emotions, navigating the wreckage of a shattered trust and the painful realization that the person she once trusted implicitly had betrayed her in the most profound way possible. Any marriage breakup is difficult, but this made it extra heart-wrenching for her, remarked a source, underscoring the magnitude of the betrayal and its lasting impact on Earhart's emotional well-being. In the face of mounting accusations, Proctor vehemently denied any wrongdoing, adamantly asserting his innocence in the face of damning evidence. There is not one ounce of truth to the allegations that I had an affair he declared, refuting the claims and maintaining his innocence, even as the specter of doubt loomed large over their fractured marriage. Sources close to the couple revealed that they had attempted to work through their issues for years following the revelation of Proctor's infidelity, grappling with the painful aftermath of betrayal while striving to rebuild the shattered trust that once defined their relationship. However, despite their best efforts, it became increasingly apparent that the wounds inflicted by Proctor's alleged affair ran deep, eroding the foundation of trust and intimacy that underpinned their marriage. As sources disclosed to page six, Earhart ultimately reached the painful conclusion that reconciliation was no longer a viable option, signaling a decisive end to their tumultuous chapter as husband and wife. Ainsley has determined that she is not interested in reconciliation, revealed an insider close to Proctor, shedding light on Earhart's unwavering resolve to chart a new course for herself in the aftermath of heartbreak and betrayal. While Proctor expressed devastation over the dissolution of their marriage in his public statement, lamenting that he did not envision this for the future of his family, it was ultimately Earhart who made the difficult decision to sever ties and forge ahead on her own. Do you think Sean Hannity is also worried about a similar situation happening in his relationship with Ainsley Earhart in the future? Leave us your comments in the section below. We hope you have found this helpful video. Don't forget to leave a like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you like it. Thank you for watching this and see you in the next videos. Goodbye.